mathematical nature of the diagonal lengths for the sequence of the first five squares arranged along a gnomon. Apply Pythagorean theorem, reduction of square roots methods, and the formula for the diagonal of any width perfect square. Results are, as noted by Cylon, the Pythagorean cult exile, for the unit square with sides equal to one each, the diagonal is square root of two. Thus, according to the formula for the diagonal of perfect squares, each further iteration is the width of one side of the square multiplied by square root of two. According to application of the Pythagorean theorem, we arrive at square root of two squared plus two squared equals square root of eight, where two squared equals four, which reduces to the same amount expressed as two times the square root of two. Likewise, for three square root of two equals square root of 18, of four square root of two equals square root of 32, and of five square root of two equals square root of 50. This is due to the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, or square root of the leg squared plus leg squared equals square root of the hypotenuse, wherein square root of 5 squared equals 25 plus 5 squared equals square root of 50. On the left, the seven planetary rulers over the twelve astrological signs of the zodiac expressed as an orthogonal matrix. On the right, the seven chakras of the kundalini along a diagonal vector between twelve regular polytopes in multiple dimensions. In this diagram, above, we see the now familiar area 25, 5 squared, However, here we see it divided into twin area 4, 2 squared, and area 6, 3 squared squares that overlap in the center to form a single base unit square. The base 4 squares are in the upper right and lower left, and between them is an arc showing the relationship between them in the center square. The measure of the leg of the area 25, 5 squared square divided in this way yields the golden ratio of one to two or two-thirds. This golden ratio, called phi, also appears in the legs of the regular pentagram as between the length of a leg under a stellation to the length of that leg as an arm of an adjacent stellation. This works out such that the length three is blue, the length two, green, and the length one red in both the diagrams above. Here we can see that by measuring the circle's radius as the hypotenuse of the golden ratio Pythagorean triangle, we can yield the larger areas of the base 8, 10, and 12 squared circles. Therefore, these are the two ways to yield a square circle from applying the Pythagorean triangle with its golden ratio of 3, 4, 5 to split the 15 degree angle difference between 45, 45 fractal expansion, base 12 hypotenuse, and the 30, 60 gnomonic expansion, base 10 hypotenuse. These lengths for the hypotenuse radius of the square circle are derived by continuing to follow the gnomonic and fractal expansion rates up to base 12, 13, and 16 areas. Here are all the fundamental measures of the Pythagorean square circle formula for any figure up to circle radius 8. One joule of energy equals one kilogram of mass traveling at a velocity of light speed squared or 89 quadrillion 875 trillion 517 billion 873 million 
681,800 square meters per second squared, where the square of one second is one second. E equals mc squared. Light speed, or 299,792,458 meters per second equals the square root of one joule of energy per each square root of one kilogram of mass. C equals the square root of E over M. One kilogram of mass equals one joule of energy exhibiting stationary density at the square root of light speed or 17,314 square meters per second. M equals E over square root of C. E 